Wall Street memes is heading to the Hamptons. Hell, with the way these prices have been going, they're not going to stop at the Hamptons. They're going to head down to South Beach, Florida. They're going to head down to the south of France. They're going to head to Monte Carlo. They're going to head to Dubai. This has been one of the most profitable coins projects in all of crypto lately, especially impressive considering we are right in the middle of a long, long bear market. So let's look at the price action right here. So it's been trading for about eight days, about exactly a week, 108 million market cap right here, peaked at around $130 million market cap. This is upward trending. There's bottom level consolidation around $100 million right there. It's a beautiful looking chart, and it's especially impressive right here. There was very little dip in the beginning because this coin did a huge, huge pre-sale. You remember, it's $25 million. I think it was actually closer to $30 million when the pre-sale was all said and done. These coins were fully unlocked too, so everyone is just choosing to hold these that's what you like to see it was done entirely on their pre-sale right there so it was done in 30 phases so the first phase phase was at the lowest the best price 2.5 cents then it went up the price of pre-sale went up 1.2 percent each of the 30 phases so then finish at the highest price 3.37 cents so highest price 3.37 cents current price 5.4 cents that means that everybody who partook in any part of the pre-sale is in the profit everyone if you bought around 3.37 cents then you're about 60 percent in the profit if you bought at 2.5 cents you are 120 percent in the profit regardless everyone is making bank that is what i like to see and again right here a very little dip these coins were fully unlocked the team promoted their you know, holding on to stake, they're offering up to 40% yields right there. They said, we encourage you to stake, but for the most part, people are either enjoying the staking mechanism or they're just choosing to hold their coins because they think this price, the price is going to go up even more in the future. They've been dead on right in the first week. We'll see where it goes. We will see what it goes. Additionally, trading volumes is very high. Check this out. So Wall Street memes coin, it's been the fourth most traded coin by volumes, most traded meme coin, right after the big three, Dogecoin, Shiba Inu, and Pepe. So that puts Wall Street memes, it's more traded than Baby Doge, it's more traded than Bones, it's more traded than Harry Potter, Obama, Sonic, 10, and U, or all the derivatives, very high trading volumes, because that's what exchange is like, because they get a cut off of each trade, that's what the revenues are. Anyways, let's dive in. We'll get into new exchanges in a sec. What is new? So perhaps coincidentally or not coincidentally, but what really helped this coin, I think, this movie came out this past week in dumb money. So the coin's been trading eight days. The movie came out five days ago. Obviously, these two are very intertwined. Dumb money, that is about the GameStop saga of 2021. It was a great movie. Did pretty well, 7.5 million opening weekend. Great reviews, Rotten Tomatoes, 85% reviewer score, 85% viewer score. I thought it was great. I give it a 100 out of 100. Beautiful. Remember, although this page right here, the, uh, the Wall Street memes have been around since October 2019. That was a year and a half before the GameStop saga happened. The GameStop saga, that is really what let this group, the subreddit in particular, really took off after that. So the, the movie... The incident and this group right here, Wall Street memes, are directly intertwined. What else? New exchanges. So OKX, this was the big exchange that they were listed on initially. They had an exclusive list agreement with OKX where for the first week they could only be listed on OKX. But the week is over, so new exchanges are added. CoinW and Gate.io, those were just added today on day eight. Gate is the number ninth ranked exchange by trading volumes in the world, and CoinW is the number 19. So CoinW, that's a tier one, number 19 right there. Big listings. Additionally, they have other, other exchanges chose to add this coin just on their own without sort of coming to any agreement or without offering a payment, et cetera. So Huobi has added it. Let's see, Mexi, L Bank, UX, those are all tier one and top 25 exchanges. Team's also campaigning for Bybit right here. Bybit's doing a voting sort of thing where, you know, a vote for your next coin. What should we list? Bybit is the number five ranked exchange in the world. So cast your votes there. That would really, really help this coin. I think it's a great fit. Bybit likes retail heavy coins. So we shall see. Twitter page keeps getting bigger and bigger. When I did my last review last week, it was like 286,000 people. Now, five days later, 292,000 people. People call it the freshest mix of internet and dating culture, trading culture on the block. Here's one of the memes from today. RIP, 125,000 students get their debt cleared. Student debt cleared. Every other student, what happened to student loan forgiveness? President Biden, midterms are over, Jack. Ha ha, RIP. The memes are fresh and funny. That's it. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think about Wall Street memes. 
Are you in it? You think it's good in the long run? Did you get into the pre-sale? Anything? Huge community. Love hearing from you guys. Be back tomorrow with a new video. Catch you later.